We are so happy today to welcome our new partner of the morning blend, Women's Care Florida, who's going to be a regular guest each week. And today we're going to kick things off with Dr. Steven Greenberg, who joins me to discuss who they are, what they offer, why they are so committed to their mission of improving the lives of women every single day. Welcome to The Blend. This is such an exciting day for us. Thank you. I appreciate you being here. So Women's Care Florida, I am familiar with it. Maybe at home you've seen their logo or have heard some friends of yours share the name. Let's discuss. What is Women's Care Florida? Well, Women's Care Florida started approximately 20 years ago when a group of uh, practices decided to merge and be a little bigger and a little more competitive in the market. And uh, it's developed in that time uh, in the last 20 years. We're now over 250 providers in uh, and approximately 50 offices um, all across St. Pete, Clearwater, Tampa, Lakeland, Plant City, Orlando, um, and, and Brandon and Riverview. So we're all, we're all over the place now. I'm uh, glad you had to say that list. And I didn't have to memorize <laughs> it there. Well, doctor, you know, when I think Women's Care Florida, I think of, you know, things like, you know, maternity and being pregnant. But there is so much more that you're able to offer women when they do want to take advantage of their health. Absolutely. We started mostly as uh, OB and GYN care for mm -hmm. most women. And in the last, especially the last 10 years, we've expanded into, uh, into multi-specialty care for women too. So really we can take care of women in all phases of their lives uh, and all sorts of problems. We have GYN cancer specialists, we have gastroenterologists, we have plastic surgeons, we have uh, uh, high-risk specialists for obstetrics, um, we have uro urogynecologists. So we have a little bit of everything just to cover all the gamut for all of women's care. We even just recently started primary care. So several offices actually have their own family practice or internal medicine doctor there. And one of the advantages there, we can keep everything sort of together. And uh, it's all in the same uh, records department, record computer. So that makes it much, much, much easier. Um, ideally, everybody's records are supposed to talk to each other on the computer, but that doesn't really happen. Uh -huh. Learn that one the hard way. Yeah, so we ha but being all together, we see everybody's notes and, and can get a lot more continuity of care and better care for the women. I mean, I even remember situations where it's like you're taking paper copies and having to go to different offices yes. and relay information the doctors tell you, which always can be so overwhelming. So having everybody working together, that is such a benefit for the patient, Absolutely. which again goes back to your mission. It does. And, and the other things that we offer. We offer, usually we offer mammogram services. We now have surgery center here in Tampa. Uh, we have subspecialists there. We are opening a surgery center in Orlando. And those are beneficial for patients mostly because having small surgeries at the hospital um, is very, very costly. So now mm -hmm. having a surgery center and doing even in-office surgery really saves the patient a lot of money. And, and the insurance companies like it. It saves them money too. Which is a win-win when it comes yes. to the medical world. It is. Well, say people are at home watching thinking, yeah, you know, I was thinking about you know, looking into a new doctor or something different, but I don't know how to get started and I got to see if I have to get referrals or, or how can people get more information and really become patients of the system that you've created? Well, basically, just looking it up on the website, womenscareflorida.com, they can find different areas. They can uh, find a physician by region, by specialty, by gender. Uh, so they can find anybody that way. Um, as we were talking about earlier, used to people used to have to have referrals and different things, and that's very uncommon nowadays. Most insurances, even with an HMO, uh, they have open access, as they call it, where you can really go wherever you want if they're in their insurance plan. And uh, so it really makes it much simpler for the patient to get started. Um, and one of the very good things about some of the new healthcare laws that weren't so good for everybody else. We've been very lucky in women's health because it's really covered a lot more screening exams, mm -hmm. annual exams, mammograms, and they're pretty much always covered by your insurance company and usually you have no copay or anything for those in a lot of situations. So the access for women is actually improved um, and trying to ratchet back some of the health care laws right now may actually hurt women more, but uh, so we're trying to fight against that a little bit. I like that. Again, going to that mission statement, really trying to take care of women. You know, we've really just scratched the surface and why they can help and they can focus on what you may need and so many reasons why. And I know we've got plenty more upcoming segments to right. just illustrate why you are standout. Again, thank you so much for joining us today. And he touched on it once, but we want to share the website one more time. For more information on how Women's Care Florida can help you, just visit the website that you see on the screen. And doctor, come back so we can talk about more. How's that sound? It. Appreciate it. Thank you for your help.